mayor of Los Angeles gave his annual State of the City address tonight, and Antonio Villaraigosa announced he is taking command in the war against gangs and their deadly violence across Los Angeles. Eyewitness News reporter Leslie Miller is live in downtown L.A. with more on the mayor's plans. Leslie. Mark, today the mayor unveiled a $24 million plan to fight gang violence in Los Angeles. It calls for an increase in the number of gang reduction zones from 8 to 12. We can't address the problem citywide unless we concentrate where the problem lives. In the next year, the city will spend $1.5 million in each gang reduction zone, most on prevention, the rest on intervention. To borrow a phrase from Tony Blair, we need to be both tough on crime and tough on the root causes of crime. The city's gang czar says the plan already shows signs of working. A pilot project in Boyle Heights and the Hollenbeck area has already reduced gang-related crime by 44 percent over the last two years. It's something called clear community law enforcement and recovery, which is an integrated law enforcement approach, along with then with social services where we saturated that community and targeted kids that were most at risk of joining gangs. I believe we're at a point now where the general public has accepted that suppression alone is not the answer to dealing with gangs in Los Angeles. Intervention and prevention is an important element. But critics say expanding the gang reduction zones is a band aid solution to the problem. If a person want to be a gang member, all he's going to do is leave that area and continue with the madness in some other part of the city. As the mayor outlined his anti gang strategy, he remembered the victims who lost their lives to gang violence in just the last three months. We all lost the son in Jamil Shaw. The mayor's mission will be accomplished by protecting the city's core services of police and fire and by fully funding efforts to put a thousand police officers on the street. Arguably, this is one of the most important issues in terms of quality of life and the, and the health of our city. And so we've got to focus additional resources on it. And focusing additional resources on policing and, of course, the new gang strategy will cost you, the taxpayer, money. So how will you pay? Well, according to the mayor's State of the City address today, residents will likely see an increase in their trash bills. We're live in downtown Los Angeles. Leslie Miller, ABC7 Eyewitness News.